Alright, well, here we are again. We're about to make yet another video. This one's gonna be for the guy called Lewis, the first dude who basically subscribed and commented on my Minecraft videos. So thank you, man. Um, yeah. Hopefully we're gonna do a test real quick to run around in this. This is the spawn area. This is a prison court. So, and we're gonna do a real quick run around. It's a little, little choppy. So we're gonna go in here real quick. No, not that one. Bring this down to about that. Even though I don't think it makes a huge of a difference. Nah, don't seem to. Oh well. We're just gonna have to do it. Okay, so... This is the spawn. At the moment, for some reason, these are blocked. I don't know why we have these blocked at the moment. They shouldn't be. One of, one of these should be... This one here. Shouldn't be blocked. So we'll unblock that real quick. That's weird. I've never seen, never seen that flicker like that. Hmm. These are the towers, that's where the guards of the prison will be standing and looking at all the prisoners out here in the field, on the courtyard or prison yard or whatever. We've got a garden over there. Uh, by the way, this ain't like a normal prison, this is a... Well, you'll see. Here's the norm Here's the doors, we don't have them set up right so that we can actually go in and out of it, since we don't have the buttons or anything set up yet. And a reception counter. In the personal belongings box. Prisoner processing holding area. Yep, and you would go in here and there'd be a guard out there that closes this. This will shut. Uh, a lot like that. I am lagging pretty bad. Illegal contraband, yep. Confiscated crap. Run over here, you got this big cool book. Um, I do believe this is for like mug shots and fingerprinting and stuff like that. I do believe. He's on Skype, even then. Prisoner processing holding area. I just went over that. Please go around the front. <laughs> Prisoner processing showers. So when you first go into prison, you know how you always have those... <laughs> Justin says, what's up? You always have those iconic, uh... Like, shower scenes, like... I'm not sure what the hell that was, but you have those iconic shower scenes where someone just chucks white powder all over somebody. Well, that's basically what this is. Showers. And a little drain system and everything. And then we have little dispensers, which we're going to somehow disguise some item as soap. Or just give you something that looks like soap. Prison records room. There is a secret in this room. I will not tell you what it is. We're probably going to tell you through little hints. But there is indeed a secret in this room. Yellow criminal or office records. Oh no, offense records. Purple cell listings and re uh, Purple are cell listings and records. Green criminal records. Red is imprisonment records. Orange is... Oh, there's something next to me. Processing records. Blue is criminal re release records. And white is visitation records. And then there's a secret somewhere in here, and I can't tell you where. There's a secret color containing some history about the uh, prison. Riot room, where we got our batons, our body armor. I do believe they might have. What the hell is yeah. Looks like something with a weird face. 
Okay, so Alan and Justin, who have basically done most of the, uh, detail and stuff. I've been, like, the layout guy. I've been the one that's kind of been telling them where to build and how to build it and all that crap. Well, not even how to build it, but you get it. Officer's Lounge and Mess. This is basically my brainchild, and they're the architect. Decaf, regular, coffee machines. Pretty, pretty basic. Please be neat. Use trash cans. So there's like all sorts of rotten shit in here. So it's pretty cool. Little, little shit to like. A cake. Cake is a lie. Everyone should know that. Um, over here you have not much. This is just one of the bends. I'll get to those later. Do 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 do. Some nice little view out here. I'm not entirely sure why the guys did this, but uh, yeah, we're building this on super flat. Don't worry about any details and land and everything later. We're really good builders and we're really serious, so if we really need some terrain, we'll build it. And here is the uh, guard overlook section where the guards can watch you while you guys, while the prisoners, and I, it's, I shouldn't really call them prisoners, these are more like the good people who don't belong in like normal society or whatever get to do stuff that I'm going to get to in a second, but this is the walkway where the guards can observe you in those environments, and then it leads right out here to this tower, where they can observe you. There should be another tower over there. I'm still not sure if I'm going to put one over there or over there, because there's no part of the place over there. Don't mind this big open spot. The second floor has not even remotely been worked on. It's basically just a floor at the moment. This, I do believe, is the workshop, if I remember correctly. Hot box. Close doors behind you. Oh, yeah. This is the uh, smelting thing in there. That's where you can smelt your stuff. I don't remember where the buttons are. Like I said, I haven't built a lot of this, so I can't really show off too much stuff. That's probably right there. Yep, lava falls out. Completely contained, so you don't have to worry about dying while you're screwing around with it. Um, you got your coolers. Cool to metal. These are workbench tables. You can work on top of them, and then you got your supplies and shit right up there for your craft. About the best we can really do in Minecraft. Uh, got a nice little... I'm not entirely sure what this is. Oh, I think it's a press. Yeah. There we go. It's a press. Uh, your materials. Clay, blaze rods, furnaces, everything you need in a, in a nice little... Place. Then you have the arts room. Canvas, paper, leather, wool, strings, and feathers. That kind of rhymed. Really nice big pictures. Who doesn't like really nice big pictures? This is the one I put in here. It's really, really pretty. You got a music box. You got some more furnaces for some reason. Oh, probably for clay and stuff. Heating clay. Use trash cans, clay and coal, charcoal and paintbrushes, and dyes. There's a really cool picture there of Endermen finding diamonds and stuff. A uh, little, kind of like, um, these are supposed to be like your, uh, oh, what the hell are they called? That your picture sits on while you paint on it. Ah, oh, hell, screw it. Can't remember at the moment. I think it begins with an S. Well, that's what that is. It's like the painting desk. And then you got normal tables for like the actual class and whatnot. And, well, there's there's those pictures. And yes, those are flags. Um, the whole place is being lit by like glowstone surrounded in trapdoors, so they look more like kinda like lights. A lot of us seem to agree that's pretty cool. This is the normal floor styling. Yes, it doesn't fit a prison very much, but we did think it actually looked pretty good if you run over here real quick and Look down there, it looks pretty nice. 
really nice lighting effect from the lights, which Justin did. It was pretty cool. Over here, we got the gym. This is the gym. We got dumbbells sitting in there, chunks of iron, weights, which are blocks of iron. Uh, here's the bench presses, which I guess that's about as good as we could really get it. I mean, you're going to have to be like Brock Lesnar or DMX or some shit to lift that crap. But Yeah, and then you got punching bags. Nice little punching bags. And that's basically the gym. That's about all we could really do. I'd love to see somehow them, like make a treadmill or something. Here's the pool. And Justin's up there contemplating something. Uh... It's a pretty normal pool. It's equal deep. Just deep enough. Uh, here's our little fountain thing. Uh, we found it was kind of empty in here, so we decided to throw that in there. And Yeah, it, it looks good enough. It's squirting water out into the both sides of the pool, so it's kind of like a how, how the water gets here and keeps getting refilled and refreshed and then you just hop up here and you got a diving board this I made you can jump so don't worry about it. and no running motherfuckers remember it is a prison it's slippery and shit <laughs> uh, I do believe yep prison guards can watch you up there um, I do realize they can't see you over there yet, so I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Because I'm the one that's doing all the prison guard crap. And we run off. And out here is where the second part of the prison building is. And fly up. And that's what you saw right there, the bottom floor of that place so far. And that's it. Um... The second floor is still needing to be built, and then the second building section. Then you got the garden. This <laughs> totally isn't a sign, it's a sword. Deal with it. We thought it'd be nice to have a little garden so, you know, people can... Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm not entirely sure what that's for. Or... Hmm. There's a secret message here in these flowers. It'll, you'll have to really take a good look at it in order to see it. It's nothing too special though, but it is pretty funny. All right, this should technically be broke too, since this is the other side of the prison. And that's one one part of the map. That's one tiny section. Alright, so we're gonna run. Sorry about my squeaky ass chair. Here is the road. You all know my typical road design. Why these are here, I don't know. I've been wanting to get rid of them for forever now. My accuracy sucks. Well, I am recording at 60 FPS, which is, I guess, the max for fraps. Until I get, you know, way more viewers.